Hello everyone! Welcome back to Skeletons. I'm Zinker, he's Derek, and uh, before we start, I would like to uh, reshare my card code for anyone that wants this limited edition pre beating the game version. Oh, I had to connect, yeah, that's right. So, I'm sharing my card. Anyone that wants it, here's the code. There you go. Limited edition. Great. Um, oh, wait, wait, what's actually... Let me look at it real quick before I go on. Uh, what's actually on it? It's on the back of it. Five kinds of curry, 47 Pokemon caught... 51 Pokemon started with score bunny. Interesting. Hey, 747. All right. So today we have another Spelliverse character to introduce. This is the strongest one yet, Derek. Okay. This one is, uh, it's completely, uh, it's, it's going to be a time, Derek. It's going to be a time. I don't know why I'm saying that. I'm half mixing. Oh, hey. Wait a Why second. are there weights and stuff here? What's up? Why are there weights and stuff here? To train? Thick Ice Milf! Oh, I love her! Please turn around so I can see you. Please. Turn around. Come on. Alright. Um, you! <laughs> you fucking asshole. You dare show your face you around here again? Nerve. Okay. Um, you got a lot of nerve being alive. Um, <laughs> alright, so, Derek. Me at me 20 years from now. I was thinking about this. Alright, so... Mm -hmm. how, 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 would it, how would be the best place to introduce this? Or rather, the funniest way to introduce this. Alright, Derek. Imagine you're a cop. You spend a long time... Uh, am I walking straight? Wait. <gasps> I mean, that was pretty good. Nice. That's pretty good. It was a little cur only a little curvature. Um. Oh God. I think I'm with a maple donut. Go ahead. Anyhow, uh, their cops don't actually have donuts. That's a racist. <laughs> That's racist. Anyhow, um, so you uh, th there's this uh, there's this girl that uh robs a bank because she needs money. Uh, so you you mm -hmm. arrest her, you put handcuffs on her, you bring her all the way to jail. You uh. You lock her in the jail cell, and, and you know it's one of those classic ones of a bunch of bars. Oh shit! I forgot. Oh no! <laughs> Whoops! I <laughs> I forgot about this. Does anyone here even remember me? Ooh. Yeah. Oh, this is good encounter music though. This is I I've never listened to his encounter music. This is real good. It sounds like you're in a casino. God damn. Who let him on the? That's the last thing I want to hear. Uh, who let him out here? How did he get here? Where's security? No, Derek. It sounds like a Sonic the Hedgehog casino. Okay, that's better. Yeah. Um. We're currently debating what to do with Challenger BD. To all our viewers, both here in the stadium and at home in front of Tally, we ask you that you please be patient. What if we lose this battle? Good question. And then the strange old lady comes out of nowhere and drags me into boot camp on fairy type Pokemon. Do you have any idea what I've been through? Covered in pink, dealing with quizzes and battles of fairy type Pokemon every day? And here I am pouring my heart out to you. When I've never lost my cool before. We reach a decision, ladies and gentlemen. The champion himself has accepted BD's sudden interruption. Is the champion showing his love by giving every trainer a chance to grow stronger, or is it a trial for Challenger Jeff? 
I like how we don't get to agree to it. The champion does for us. It's kind of random, but I have to say I do like it. Plus, his song is great, so. It's the same one, but He's it's got just the great. He's gotten serious here. No one should have, he shouldn't have been allowed in the, on the premises. Okay. They have a picture up with his, of him that says, do not allow in, ever. Actually, that doesn't. Anyhow, so, you've arrested this girl, you picture lock- of him that just says, asshole. You've arrested this girl. And uh, you lock her in the classic prison. Uh, I'm, I'm getting mad at the TV. Prison. It keeps flashing on and off. Sorry. Uh, it's this fucking $500 TV, but whatever. Uh, so uh, uh, you put you put her in the jail cell. And you're like, this will hold you for a real long time. She snaps her fingers. The jail the bar the jail bars disappear you're in disbelief okay you're upset you're like all right but i'm just gonna lock you in another jail cell she snaps her fingers again the entire prison disappears it's just you okay and this girl may i introduce you how did it, why didn't she do this to the handcuffs <laughs> it was harder to snap in that position <laughs> all right May I introduce you to Oh Snap, a completely <laughs> neutral force in the skeletons in the Spelliverse. <coughs> oh Snap has one power. When she snaps her fingers, anything or anyone can disappear or reappear. She has a basically. Thanos' his entire power when he has the Infinity Gauntlet. Well, just the making people disappear and not disappear thing. Mm -hmm. This is her. So I came up with this because I think I was telling Derek, uh, he said something about watching a video, and I said, oh yeah, well, not anymore. I'm like, just imagine your video. Your entire laptop just fades away. Uh, she can snap away anything. The concept of love. Mm -hmm. Snap, it's gone. <laughs> Concepts, people. She wants to wipe out 50% of the entire universe. She can. She can do it right then and there. If she wants. This is her power, Derek. I feel like she, should, feel like she shouldn't have a problem of robbing it. She shouldn't have been robbing the bank in the first place. <laughs> Derek, she can't make money appear unless she snapped it away. Obviously. Okay, but she could. Okay, let me put it this way: then. she could snap away the bank, go into the vault, and grab, pick up a couple of piles of money. She could and snap away the law then, that prevent that ma that doesn't ma that makes it illegal for her. To she rob. could have snapped away. Could snap away me coming to arrest her. I don't know why I sent out uh fucking uh Doug by the way, but I thought it was a good idea. So here we are. I actually should probably get an Aurora Veil up. Um, anyhow. No. Uh, so, she's really, she's really powerful. She can snap away anything. You could be about to eat your sandwich there, she can snap it away. And then she'd be like, just kidding, makes it reappear again. Then, you, as you're about to bite it, she makes it disappear again. Or, she could get rid of just the baloney on the sandwich. And you just have a lettuce sandwich, or whatever. Uh, I don't eat vegetables. Like, ever. She made it reappear. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm gonna lose this Gardevoir. I have nothing to take it down. Like, actually. Oh, maybe we will we'll find out what happens if we lose this fight. I guess so. Um, it depends if he lets me get off an Aurora Veal or not. Nope. He, he's going for the kill. Huh. What do I do? <laughs> what level oh, you is Pokemon? Is that even that and strong? Reveal. It's just that I don't have well, any... For, though. I didn't have a steel type to deal with this. Um, That's what's fucking me over here. I got Tappy, though. Tappy will uh, teach him a thing or two. Um, so, 
Uh, I think this is, uh, I, I, I don't know. I love the idea of this because I just thought, so imagine, like, you go through, like, Avengers Infinity War and Avengers Endgame, and then they introduce to the MCU. Oh, snap. <laughs> and then you're just sitting yeah. there and, like, what? We could have had this at any, we could have. We didn't need to do all this work. I I just think that'd be funny. Yeah. Just uh, she just has this power. Uh. So I don't know. What do you you got? Not you got anything? With, oh wait a second. Ha! Huh. I just played myself. Okay, I have an idea. There we go. I forgot I could dance. It's my greatest skill. Okay, well. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. I'm not dead. You live. Yeah. Up the hail sun. Yeah. That's okay. It, I don't need it anymore. I just need to heal. Um. I. 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 I can outlive him. It's just. It's going to be annoying. Please hurt yourself in confusion. So I, I or don't. in the moment, I just had an idea for a character, er, a character idea that I is it's a, their character in My Hero Academia. So it's not really that ori original. After now that I think about it, uh, just, or there's a similar we're character. We're not Derek. We are not stealing from anime. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really pissed that she snapped out of confusion. But also, I don't know why she used Wish. In my defense, Sinker, I had the idea, and then I realized it's just a character in that. Sort of. Okay, so, go for they it. They stole my idea. Uh, I don't know. I haven't thought of what to call, to call them. Uh, I guess maybe like Monch or something. Uh, this hero or villain. Probably more villain. Uh, can gain the power of anything they eat. They also have the ability to eat anything. Okay. So if they eat a gun, they gain the power of gun. Okay. If not not permanently, just like while well, it's in their digestive system. Uh, right. If they eat like a sledgehammer, they gain the power of sledgehammer. If they eat a brick, they gain the power of brick. This is a character. They eat the Infinity Gauntlet. They gain the power of Infinity Gauntlet. No, this is sort of the character in the show. Yeah, um, whenever he, any food that he eats, he gains the power. He gain he gains the ability to transform uh, parts of his body to that food. So if he eats like calamari, he can like sprout like he can make like octopus tentacles from his hands. You can't eat a gun. Or if he eats like like. Uh, that's why I said this character can. Eat, this character can. This character can eat anything. He sucks it right down. Okay. I guess. My little pony, apocalypse pony. He eats exp if he eats dynamite, he can gain the power of dynamite once. What? Once, <laughs> because like dynamite, <laughs> he does not survive. Uh, he like eats a lamp. He gains the power of lamp. Right. We already have that character. We don't need that. Well, he gets he can use it as long as the inside justice system. Once it's gone, then he, he loses the power of lamp. I'm talking about the mighty lantern, not the guy that turns into a lamp once. Oh, just so you know. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot he, he he's here too. Okay, we don't need to give him crit, but thank you. Um, oh, I can Dynamax. I'm just going to. I've used a lot of healing items on oh. this battle. To be fair, I was not ready. Also, he only brought four Pokemon to this battle. Yeah, I guess if, uh, yeah, he only does. Uh, I guess because they're all Psychic Fairy. Yes. The, he brings all the Psychic Fairies. No, he has Mawile to begin with. Oh, that's right. And also, Mawile. I'm really annoyed at the amount of crits this guy's getting. It's pissing me off. 
Uh, it's very unnecessary. Um. So let's also like for this for this hero. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's say they also eat the uh, uh, like, or they if they ingest like the DNA from like some other hero or whatnot, they can they gain their power. They could gain their power. So like, if he like eats like fruit kinesis is like, like part of fruit kinesis he could gain fruit kinesis okay yeah I don't know when he's gonna eat part of fruit kinesis maybe he eats some of his hair or something do you remember that fruit kinesis becomes a bad guy at some point in spell verse 4 boy case you got he, he traded out his Hatterene for a different one. Yes. Well, no, he's never Dynamax Hatterene before. No, but he had a Hatna, which couldn't be a G-Max. Yeah, there's Pokemon that begin as a G-Max before they're, uh, they evolve. Yeah, I guess they do that. Charmander. I guess they do do that with uh, Charmander, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a fire move. <laughs> Yeah, it's a nightmare. That hurt! And, uh, turn the weather on me. But it's okay, I think I win. You definitely go first. Yeah. And Hailstorm should kill. Yeah. That's it for his Hattering. A critical hit! Ugh. <sighs> I, you know what, if I, if, if I could choose one person to narrate my life, it would be the announcer from the original Pokemon Stadium. And the epic battle continues! Two Magikarp versus each other. <laughs> that dude was the best. <laughs> he really was. I couldn't win, but at least I was able to show everyone how great fairy types are. You liked psychic types, traitor! Trainer. Hey, BD, that was some match. I still don't know if, you're, if he's BD or BD or... I was going to use retiring as an excuse to get away from that old lady. You just keep messing up my plans. I hope everyone cheering me on like this. I have no choice but to continue my training as the fairy-type gym leader. Though I suppose my talents will be able to overtake Miss Opal in no time. The stadium is filled with voices cheering on these two young trainers. Now, Challenger Jeff, please head back to the locker room so that you can rest up from the unexpected match. Thanks. Remember, one of them committed uh, uh, vandalism of a historic site. I couldn't think of the crime. Well, to be the fair, other one technically it was the chairman because it's the chairman's <laughs> Pokemon. <laughs> So the chairman's the bad guy. <laughs> this is. I mean. I. Next time on Spellitons. Bye bye.